Hey everyone, so good news, I've managed to change my Shopify store base currency from British pounds to US dollars. So if you've seen my video yesterday, you'll uh, have seen that I was um, really sort of frustrated because I wanted to install the Amazon app onto my Shopify store, but I was unable to because the Amazon app only works for stores that have US dollars as their basic currency. My store was set up with my British credit cards, I'm a, I'm a British citizen, um, and so its base currency was set to uh, British pounds. So I wasn't able to install the Amazon app and use the Shopify Amazon integration that I've been talking about for the last few weeks. But following uh, me expressing my uh, frustration and uh, the fact that I sort of hit a span in the works and didn't know what to do, I got some comments from you guys, from my followers, uh, basically pointing me in the direction that I didn't, I wasn't aware of, and offering a solution. Um, so now I have switched to US dollars. I can go back to planning my marketing and planning my store to run on both Shopify and Amazon, and I'm over the moon. And I just wanted to say thank you. This is really one of the reasons I'm loving this channel and loving the community that's growing around the channel. And it's just because of the the help and the assistance that everyone offers you know we're all watching these channels watching information about dropshipping and, ship and Shopify and print on demand because we've got a shared interest and I love how all of you guys are helping me out along the way and having other people out along the way and offering suggestions that um, I hadn't previously considered uh, it's fantastic uh, so yeah I just want to say a really big thank you there's like four there's four subscribers in particular that uh, left comments on my videos um, on yesterday's video that basically led me to finding the solution. Um, so they are Joseph Cool, I am Jackpot, Everything Juicy and Mickey Gizor. So thank you so much guys, like that really helps. You basically basically suggested deactivating Shopify payments from the store, then going to um, Shopify settings, changing my currency and then going back to Shopify um, and setting up a different payment system. So I didn't realise it was actually the Shopify payment settings that were stopping me from changing my um, currency on the store. But once I deactivated Shopify payments, I was able to go to uh, the settings, go from British pounds to US dollars. And when I went back to the payment system to set up some payments to let my customers um, pay on my store, Shopify payments had disappeared. I was no longer allowed to use Shopify payments. And I think it's because I was trying to sell in US dollars, but I had a British uh, address um, attached to my account on Shopify. So just because I was a British citizen and I wanted to accept dollars, Shopify payments didn't allow me to accept payments in Shopify payments. But I was able to select Stripe, which is a different payment gateway. Um, it's a little bit extra charge, like a 2% charge per transaction uh, that goes to Stripe. Um, in order for you to use their payment system. But I was able to use uh, Stripe on my website instead of Shopify payment so my customers can oops, can now like still use their credit cards and their debit cards to pay for the products on my website but it just means I'm able to sell in US dollars rather than British pounds which therefore means I can target an American audience which was the goal from day one. So thank you so much for those four and thank you so much just for all my subscribers in general and people that leave comments on my videos it's always a massive help and I really appreciate it. Um, so thank you very much. Um, back to daily videos tomorrow. I just wanted to do this video today to um, give you guys this information like as soon as I found it, offer my thanks up. Um, but I'll be back to the daily videos from tomorrow and the general updates on Thursday. So if you don't subscribe to the channel already, make sure to subscribe to Start Starting Up. Um, this channel that you're watching this video on right now where I explore online business ideas, so that's the form of like dropshipping, e-commerce, print-on-demand, trying to make a success of it myself, so you can learn from my mistakes and my successes, and also from, as I explained earlier, the like really informative posts that uh, fellow watchers leave on my videos. Um, and also, if you uh, follow this channel, you're interested in e-commerce and online business, make sure to subscribe to my newsletter that goes out every two